Hey there everyone, Paradise Gamer 13 here, and I like how I just went from what is probably the fastest star in this level to probably the longest. Um, so what I'm going to be doing in this level is I'm gonna go ahead and get the wing cap again. Again, I don't oh well, as long as I don't run into that stupid pokey. Um, I don't think it's necessary. But is this a one up? I don't remember. I'm gonna get it just in case. Oh, it's the shell! Okay. Well, I don't really need the shell. Um but I can get off the shell. I'm trying to run into the sign. There we go. <laughs> I'm trying to run into the sign to get off of it. But um, anyways, what we're gonna want to do is. Oh, I just realized too. Okay, it's been a while since I played this, but I forgot that it shows you where the star is on the, the bottom of the, uh, the bottom screen. Um, but anyways, what we're gonna want to do is we're gonna want to go back over here, but instead of going into that little um, the spot where the star is um, up right at top the uh, pyramid there. We're actually going to go down uh, right below it into this little opening. Again, you definitely don't need the, the wing cap for that. I'm positive of that. Um, however, you might need the uh, the the shell. I don't, I don't even think you need that, though. I'm not, not 100% certain. I usually just use the wing cap. Anyways, um, as you can see, I'm in the pyramid. Um, and this is, like I mentioned, again, probably the longest of the bubbles in the Shifting Sandland. However, you know, that doesn't really make it, like, unbearably long or anything. It's probably about five minutes or so. Oh, crud, I'm gonna get... yeah. <laughs> um, I forgot that he goes all the way up to the top of the uh, ceiling, but oh well. It's not the end of the world. Um... Also, I need to get my bearings because I don't actually remember which path it is that I'm supposed to... I think I'm going the right way. But there's multiple ways that you can get up to the top, so it's not like it's, like, one set path. Yeah, um... I'm actually going to look and see. Uh, maybe I want to go that way. By the way, that, that, it's not the end of the world if you fall into that sand like I did, obviously, because you don't immediately sink. Oh, oh, cool. The, uh, the flower, the power flower thing. So that's nice. Um, makes it a lot easier to get up here. As long as I can maneuver my way correctly. Uh, assuming you're playing as Mario, I didn't mention that, but I mean, I guess that's... I just assumed that was kind of a given. So, if you're not playing as Mario, then unfortunately for you, you don't quite get that uh, that benefit. But if you are, then you do. Uh, so I would definitely recommend as playing as Mario. But if you are playing as someone else, then it just might take you a little bit longer. It doesn't take that long, like I said, but you just have to, you know, do a little bit more platforming. And honestly, though, the platforming, though, isn't actually that difficult in this area. Not compared to, like, I don't know. Uh, well, the Bowser levels. Uh, nothing like the Bowser levels. Not that the Bowser levels are that hard themselves, but it's just... And there's my phone. Just a second. Ugh, sorry about that. So, as I was saying... Fred, I hate it whenever my, I have to answer my stupid phone and I always lose my train of thought. But I think what I was intending on saying was that uh, this star isn't that hard and just... Oh yeah, but I was talking about the platforming. So, as you can see, I'm already here. This is probably... Not the hardest platforming part, but yeah, like that, if you mess up the jump, uh, you have quite a ways back down to fall and climb back up here. Like I said, though, thankfully, I don't think there's any, like, instant death uh, quicksand in here. I think you just... I mean, you can die from the quicksand, but it's pretty slow to get to that point. I mean, you can easily get out of it. Um, so that being said, this wasn't too hard of a star as you saw, especially if you're using Mario. If you're not, um, you just kind of have to make your way up there without the help of the Power Flower, really. Um, so definitely use Mario if you want this to be super easy. Anyways, um, that's going to be it for this video. If you guys like this video, I'd really appreciate you giving it a like and potentially subscribing to my channel if you haven't done so and you want to get notified of future content and stuff. And as always, I hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks again for watching.